Hi YouTube, it's a lovely rainy Sunday evening here in Cedar Rapids. It's the last day of my vacation. And what I did was I made myself a lovely little telephone line simulator uh, using some stuff that I had lying around the apartment. So what I'm doing is this is a 500 series Bell phone. This particular unit dates to 1984, which would have been after they uh, uh, were broken up, but the actual components inside are much older since they tended to recycle things. And my Howard Miller wall clock is telling me that it's 8 p.m. But anyways, how I did this was, was that I used my stereo amplifier here, my old GVC. I got both channels hooked up through wire going to a wall ward. In this case, it's the old AC adapter for one of my routers. And it's important when you do this that you have a, a, a wall ward that outputs, outputs AC power as opposed to DC power because the DC power won't work. And so basically what's going on here is that the amplifier feeds into the transformer here which steps up the voltage from the audio output and it rings the bell here. And now this particular phone that I found needs about 50 volts minimum to, to, uh, to ring. And so what I did in Audacity here, I made uh, ring cadences. Uh, the top line is the US ringtone, the middle one is the British ringtone, and the bottom one is just flat out full on ring. And so when you do that, these are the specs that I did. I used a square wave at 20 hertz. 20 hertz being the resonant frequency that the bell in the phone rings at. So if I hit solo here on American Ring and I hit play, Or, if you wanted a British style ring, I can solo the second track here. Or, let's just say you were a prankster and you wanted to be annoying. Don't mind that play there, that was just dinner. But any ugh. but anyways. You take the phone off, you can definitely hear the uh through the receiver the uh the 20 hertz running cycle. And I will pop up the top track here. And I'll hold it up to the mic so that you can actually hear it. Now it's going to ring again. This will also work with uh, electronic phones too. So my phone is now ringing. But it'll still, but it's still ringing because I got no way to control that. And it's going to start ringing again, I bet. Yep. Let's see what the electronic ringer does with uh, the British ring. Ah, it's picking up the cadence. Now it's trying to answer. Let's see how the electronic ringer handles just full on continuous ring. Oh, 
That one's doing a little bit. While I'm at it, I should probably show you a video of what the mechanism looks like when it rings. So I'll get it going here and I'll hold the receiver down to activate the circuit. So yeah, that is my lovely little random video for tonight. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.